Hi guys, so if you guys would like to see what I do with this Carly Bible palette, please log in and review. Thanks guys so much and I appreciate your support. So if you don't have this palette, please pick it up and have fun with it. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to my baby. So, I've already primed my face, moisturized it, and I've already did my brows. So, I went in with, and before I rub it in, I just want to let you know I went in with the NYX eyeshadow base in pearl white. So, I'm putting that all over my lids. I'm just going to blend that into my lid. And again, this is in NYX Pearl White. So I'm just blending that in and trying to get a flat like canvas okay so now that you know I have the eyeshadow base blended in I'm going to take um, a little bit of this um, concealer that I use to do my brows and I'm just gonna just take just a little bit of it and I'm gonna go just above the pearl white that I put in. And a lot of people, they say don't put concealer above your um, um, eyes whenever you're doing your makeup. There are no rules to makeup. And I simply did it because I am going to, one, I wanted to keep that natural hue I wanted to keep the natural hue color above my eyes and today of course I'm going to be using the Kylie Bible um, palette the new deluxe palette but first I'm going to go in using the elf mad matte palette and I'm just going to use this color right here as my base so I'm going to use that color as my base. So, um, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to swipe a little bit of that. It's a little bit too much. And I'm just going to go just above just above my eye lid. Yeah, right there in like the crease area. Just above the crease area. And I'm just going to go in a um, back and forth motion. And what I like about this matte matte color is that, you know, the colors are all matte and they are silky and they are so, these colors are matte but they are so buttery. So I'm just setting my under eye concealer with this color. Basically, it's serving as a base and it's setting the concealer in place so that it does not crease. And so I'm just working that in. And again, I, I use the NYX 
eyeshadow base because again it was, that one is in pearl white it has the little um pearly glitters um in it and it gives you like that mauvey mauvey um look anyway so it's one of the palettes that i do have that's in sync already with the kylie bible palette and so now that I've used that color, I'm going to go in, I use that color, I'm going to go in and darken it up just a little bit with that next color that I just showed you. And I'm just going to go right on top of it. And that's just to deepen it just a little bit. And that's just basically what I wanted to do. I'm done with that. I'm going to go ahead and pull out the Kylie Bible palette. And I didn't look at my previous video where I used this palette because I didn't want to recreate the same look. So what I'm going to do is try to go in and use colors that I didn't use at all. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use this Mar this marvel color is the second row third color and then i'll probably go in on my over my lid with that with this color right here it's like a pearly color but so i'm going to use first the second row third color and then i'm going to use on my eyelid the fourth color on the first row so Go ahead and grab that color and just put it right and if you guys can see the color just popped as soon as I set it on top of that base that I put in it just popped and I like the way it popped and then you just Blend, blend, blend. You guys probably heard that a hundred times on YouTube when it comes to these colors. You just blend, blend, blend. And I'm just going to go ahead and keep blending. And I'm going to pause and come right back before I change colors, guys. Okay. So, I went in and blended. And I'm just blending just a little bit more. And I, don't, I know you guys can see how it just deepened the color. So, then now I'm going to go ahead and now that a little bit of that color has fell on the lid, I'm going to go ahead and go in with a little bit of, a little bit more of the NYX eyeshadow base, just a little bit, not too much. Make sure the eyeshadow color pops. Because it does have a little shimmer to it. And as you guys can see, I just kind of focused on my lid area. And then I'm just going to pat it. I'm not going to rub. I'm just going to pat it. Pat it. Pat it in that. Pat it into that area. So now that I've did that, I'm going to go ahead. Oh, and I was blending with this. Oh, it was a BS Smalls brush that I have in the BS um, Smalls collection, which I'll do a review on that, guys. That's what I was blending with. So I'm just now going to go ahead and go in with um, this Coastal Scents Bamboo Brush. And I'm going to pick up that first row color, the fourth color. And it's like a pinkish color and I'm gonna put that on the, the lid 
and I'm not sure if you guys can see, but it's giving like a, a, a marble color. It's like a two to three tone color, like a gold, a pink with some shimmer in it. So it's actually, if you can see, it's changing shades as I move my face. It's changing. I guess it's a holographic color. I don't know, but I think it's really pretty. So I went over my lid. If you guys can see, it's changing colors. It's like a gold and pinkish color. And so I'm just doing the other side. And again, I'm just patting. I'm not rubbing. I'm just patting it in the area where I applied the NYX Pearl White Eyeshadow Base. And again, I, again, I use that base because of the uh, ingredients that it has, and it has it gives off a pearl, iridescent look. So using this uh, holographic color that changes into two tone colors, I think that'll make it pop. So if you look above my eye now, my eye has like a a two tone look to it. I mean, it's so gorgeous. I'm not sure how the lighting is picking up. But it matches what I'm wearing, so it has like a two-tone look to it. And it is so pretty. Then I'm going to take the last color, which is... So... I went in with this marble color on top of the other colors I put in. Then I, I'm sorry, let me hold it up more. I went in with this color first above my crease, my transition color. Then I went in with the pinkish color that looks like it's mixed with this color. And I'm going to put this on the inner corners of the eye. So put that darker orange color. Yeah, right there. And just pat it in. Okay, and I'm going to flip my brush around and dip back into that pink again. And go. And the reason why I like this palette is that I don't have to go in and do this like most people go in and try and get a blend of color to get this I look I don't you don't have to do this with that color that particular color and so now I'm gonna go back with the same BS small blending brush and just blend over it just to clean it up a little bit And then after I do that, I'm going to take, I'm going to take, I use this color first to go right here above those two colors. And I'm going to go in with this color more in the outer corners of my eyes. And then I'm going to pull it forward. Okay, so now that I have applied those colors, oh, so gorgeously, I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of my makeup, and I'll be back to show you guys the finishing look. And this is what the Kylie Bible eye look is looking like. So right now, 
right now guys i am just going in with the studio fix sps 15 and um nw47 and that is the foundation that i am applying all over my face And now that I have my foundation on, I can kind of see if I like to go in with a brow bone color, depending on what my consistency right there. So make sure that's evenly distributed. And I'm all mesh daddy and I'll be right back guys so I end up grabbing my elf um blush and I'm gonna use this pink color right here okay finally something And I like that. I like the way that came out. So, I like that. I'm feeling that. So, I like the way that came out. That right there, I'm feeling. I really like the way that came out. <sighs> Ran through three, three blushes. And then something. So now on to the lip color. I'm going to go ahead and line my lips with this brown liner. Let me get all this that I got going on off. Which was just um some gloss. um Some chapstick rather. And uh, I have two colors that I'm debating on what I want to go with for my lip color with this look. And it is the Perfect Tone Matte Lip by Black Radiance. And the Lip Color Matte in Eclipse by LA Colors. And these are the new lippies, liquid lipsticks, matte lipsticks that they have out for both brands. So, hmm. Which one y'all think I should go with? Hmm. I'm going to try this one since I've already tried that one this weekend. So I've lined my lips with the brown liner and I'm going in with this um, lip color by LA Colors in Eclipse. And when I say, mm, this is my new bae, this is my new bae. Oh, when I say this is my new favorite, this is my new favorite. I like it. It's almost like a purple lavender. Oh, this this is a color that I have been looking for. And once I get my light down packed, you guys will be able to see how gorgeous this color is. Yes, I'm glad I got to go pick up another one of those. Just so I can have a backup. And it's going to dry matte. But what I'm going to do. Mm, because I like it. What I'm going to do when it dry matte. I love it. It's pretty. So guys. Now that I have allowed that color to dry. And I blended it. I'm going to go ahead and go in with some gloss. Finish this look and show you guys the final look. 
And as I said, I'm just taking a, I let the matte, I let the, I put the brow liner on, then the matte look at lip, uh, glow, uh, stick. And then I'm just going in with some, and the matte lip, lipstick is by LA Colors. And then I'm going to take this LA Colors glass, glass lip gloss on this brush stick. And I'm just patting it into my lip. Again, I'm not rubbing it. I'm just patting it into my lip. So now that I am done with uh, my lips and I have completed my blush and makeup, I'm going to go in with some setting spray. And that's it. Uh, 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 baby, uh, 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 yeah.